Hello, today we are making baked rice pudding. Here's how to make it. First of all, we are going to boil some rice. So, in a saucepan, pour one cup of water. When it reaches boiling point, pour two tablespoons of rice in. And let the rice boil for 8 to 10 minutes until it cooks but doesn't get mushy. Then rinse it out and set aside. Next, in a pot, pour about 400 ml of milk, leaving the rest 100 ml for later. Over medium heat, let milk simmer. Meanwhile, combine 3 quarters tablespoon of starch with the remaining milk. Mix and set aside. In order for starch to resolve and not to get all lumpy, milk shouldn't be hot. That's why we spared some of it. Near boiling point, add 1 4 cup of sugar in your saucepan and constantly stir the milk to prevent it from burning. Then add milk starch mixture in. In a bowl, combine 1 egg yolk with 1 teaspoon of nutmeg powder and half teaspoon of vanilla extract. Little by little, add boiling milk in the bowl and quickly stir the mixture. Repeat this process for 3 times, then add this to the saucepan while stirring. This will even the temperatures out so that your egg won't set. Add rice in After giving it a few quick stir, transfer the pudding mixture into serving size ovenware and preheat your oven at 220 degrees. These serving size ones are should be placed in a bigger ovenware because you'll need to pour some water in for rice pudding mixture to bake evenly. Next, send them to oven for 25 to 30 minutes at 220 degrees. They should be done baking when they look like this. You can serve these balls of deliciousness by drizzling some honey and sprinkling some crushed hazelnuts on. Even though it is somewhat laborsome, the end result is definitely worth the effort. Hope you give this a try too. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you liked it and tell us in the comments what would you like to see us make in the next videos. Until then, subscribe and be a member of our club.